hands together and let's welcome our preacher, our friend, our pastor, our minister. Somebody say, Godly, Godly. Godly, Godly. I said, Somebody shout, Godly, 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 Godly. Godly, 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 Godly. Come on, somebody, lift your hands to heaven right about now. Lift your hands towards heaven right about now. Somebody give God some praises in this house tonight. Somebody give God some praise. Give him some praise. Give him some praise. Give him. Wait, you, 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 can, you can never give God too much praise. Somebody give him some praise tonight. I mean, God is a wonderful God. Hallelujah. When I look where I'm coming from and where I'm going, I say, I got to give him thanks and praise. Hallelujah. Give us worship him tonight. Father, you are in the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody say, Hallelujah. Father, you're worthy, hallelujah. Jesus, you're worthy to the praise, hallelujah. You may be seated if you can, hallelujah. Bless God. Somebody say hallelujah. 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 My God, how so much I want to come from? <laughs> Jesus. No, I want to hear about. I oh, tell him something. A Jesus tell him. Give my praise for Jesus tell him. Hallelujah. My God. Look at this place tonight. Mm, 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 mm. You guys come for a treat. Yeah. But I want to tell you something. I come for a treat too. Yeah. If you don't think you're not going to eat all of the food tonight and I give me none of them, make a sad mistake. Hallelujah. Look at, oh my God, look at the kids, look at the kids. Put your hands together for the children. They are here tonight. They are here tonight, my God. What a wonderful night we have last night. My God, somebody slap your hand for Jesus tonight. Hallelujah. Bless God. Let me see the hands of all the people that were here last night. My God, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Let me see the hands of all the people that were here Wednesday night. My God, look at that, look at that. Let me see all the hands of the people that were here Wednesday and last night. Mm, 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 mm. Look, God, it's growing, it's growing, it's growing. Let me see the hands of all of the people that have been here all three nights. My God, look at that. Let me see the hands of all of the first time. My God, look at that. All. My God, no, 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 no. No, them hear something. Somebody tell them something. You saw people in the second day. You don't get no sweet around here tonight. A sulfur bit as you get. Somebody say that. <laughs> Bless God. But we have a wonderful time last night. I want to bless every staff, everybody, everybody, every ministers in the house. Uh, um, um, everybody seated on the platform tonight. My um, bearers, the men of God that come to bless me tonight, to stand up with me tonight. Pastor, we want to bless you tonight. Hallelujah. Minister Richard Anderson, Minister Devon. Hallelujah. Deacon Clark. My God. And evangelist. Go Man, I got a long time. You know, see you know? The last time you see you know, me and the on a plane about Jamaica. That was the last time. My God, I'm in area DJ now. <laughs> Jesus, please. No, sir. The new tune is rough. I hear it today on the radio. I say, Lord God, them can't hold the man of God now. Jesus. The song you're in the pan, kick out the foot and if you love sweet Jesus. Trump around and if you. Shut up, run for him now. In arm and be dangerous. Evangelist, goal. we love you, man of God. We love you. Hallelujah. But God is going to do something. Extraordinary tonight. Somebody say extraordinary. extraordinary. Somebody say extraordinary. extraordinary. Somebody say do it, Jesus. Do it, Jesus. So Lord, Lord, give us a word tonight. Word tonight. So Lord, Lord, bless us tonight. Bless us In Jesus' name. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. I need you to pray while I'm ministering tonight. Um, I've been... I've been fasting for the whole entire day. I've not eaten as yet. Hallelujah. The Lord told me to do it, to do it. And many times I try to break, but the Lord won't allow me to break. Hallelujah. Right now my flesh is weak, but I'm very happy when my flesh is weak. Because when my flesh is weak, then God will come and his strength will make me strong in my time of weakness. Hallelujah. Bless God. Today I was so ill. I was so ill. Uh, seeing like the flu tried to eat me. I was coughing. My throat is burning right now. Um, they have to send some medication for me. Hallelujah. 
Bless God and people call and say, oh, you're doing what I'm saying. Excellent, I'm good because you got to understand that uh, you can't look at your circumstances and speak what you see. Hallelujah. For the Bible says, let, let, let the poor say I'm rich and let the weak say I'm strong. Hallelujah. So how you're feeling, you got to speak the opposite. My God. Uh, I mean, when you're in a situation and the money now run, don't tell yourself that you're broke. Better you say, I'm, I'm a little financial challenge at this time. But, but, but later on, but, but, but later on, hallelujah. I'm going to be so blessed, so blessed, so blessed. I'm looking for a, a particular face, a particular face, hallelujah. Can somebody run to my back and get me a, a CD, a get up free CD? God told me to do this tonight. I don't know why. When God told me to do things, I just do it. I don't know why, but I just do it, hallelujah. A, a, a preacher come to church one night and God said, um, 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 no, a gentleman come to church one night and God said, I want you to go to the front of the church and do some cartwheel. You know what they call cartwheel? Some flip. And the man of God was like, God, are you crazy? Cartwheel? For what? God said, just go do some cartwheel. Hallelujah. And when he obeyed God and he did the cartwheel, um, a man ran up to the altar at the same time. He was a gunman, an old juggist, an old murderer, and gave his life to God. And this man was like, God, oh, what, what is this? Because you see, God used the foolish things of this world to confound the wise. When God tell you to jump, don't ask him why. Ask him how oh, I. Hallelujah. I'm going to take my time tonight because I'm going somewhere. Hallelujah. And so, and so, God was, God, and, and, and when they give that drug dealer the mic to, 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 um, to, to just testify, he said, God, I want to get saved. And I said I was going to the church tonight, but I said, God, I want a sign. And he said, God, you're going to be a hard one. If you make a man do some cartwheel in the church tonight, I mean, no, I say, tonight or my night. <laughs> and so that man was obedient. He did some cartwheel. And when he did some cartwheel, he said, yes, God, this is my confirmation and God bless him. Mommy, I don't know, I don't, I don't know who you are. But I saw you all three nights. Hallelujah. And every night my eye come in contact with your eyes. And while I was praying today, you came up in my spirit. God said, give her a CD. I don't know. I don't know. That might not be your thing, but God said, give her a CD. I don't know why. I, I, I know you was coming to that because God showed me you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless God. But God is a wonderful God. I'm not going to hold it so long like last night. Hallelujah. One lady said, you're lucky. I said, woman go home. The woman said, no. I said, then train stop run. Them said, train and stop run around here. <laughs> then I said, oh, yeah, go home. She said, look here, me walk. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. You guys are greedy around here. Yeah. Oh, you're so greedy for word. I saw the cream for word all the while. Yeah. My God, you guys are greedy for word. But God is good. Before I get into the message, tonight is the last night for now. I believe that God is going to bring me back again for another season. Hallelujah. And so I said, God, where should I go? He said, New York. I said, we are in New York. He said, just go on to New York. I will show you what to do and where to go next. Hallelujah. And God told me that I should leave out of my comfort zone and come to New York. Hallelujah. God said, there are some young men in New York and some young women that I want to use you to touch their lives. God said, because the thing that you are coming out and you are still into it, because you have been there and done that, you speak their language, you walk like them, talk like them, dress like them, move like them, understand them. When you speak, they're going to understand you. Hallelujah. Because you guys speak the same language and I'm going to pull them out. Somebody say hallelujah. We were here last night when we see a little young lady that was trying to get into the gang that they call the Crips and the Blood. And God pulled her out. Another young man was here last night. He was on the brinks of losing his life. God showed me the casket. God showed me his mother weeping. Do you see what I'm last night? And we break that curse and God pulled him out. Hallelujah. I was fasting and praying today and God showed me and God said to me, man of God, there's going to be a revival. There's going to be a revival in this place. And it's going to be a revival where young people Parents, you don't even have to pressure them to come to church. You don't even have to ask them or quote a scripture to them. But they're going to just walk over to you and say, Mommy, today is my day. I need to go to church and get baptized. God says, Want to do that? If you believe it, give God a praise tonight. Somebody say, Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Bless God, bless God, bless God, bless God, bless God. I want to bless you, Marvin. 
You're a wonderful stunt man, I'm gonna let you see you. I came here a couple of years ago, a couple of years ago, around six to seven years ago, and I want to share my testimony, and no one would let me on the platform. No one, no one would give me the opportunity to come in the church, to even testify and talk to the young people. And I don't forget where I'm coming from, hallelujah, because if you burn your bridges behind you, something might happen, you want to go back over there and the bridge gone, hallelujah. So I always give respect where respect is due. And God's, I mean, somebody from St. Thomas, my friend named Julie, called this young man and said, uh, Mervyn, I have a friend in New York by the name of Goddy Goddy. Nobody know him, but he has a wonderful testimony. He's a man of God, and the man of God said, no, I just send him over. Amen. And this man gave me the first opportunity to speak in the church. I'll never forget Brother Mervyn. Hallelujah. God bless you, sir. God bless you. God bless you. Hallelujah. God has put a word in my spirit tonight. Hallelujah. And I really am so excited to share this word to you tonight. Hallelujah. I'm going to go right ahead because I believe that God is going to do something strong tonight. Something, somebody says something strong. Something strong. Say something strong. Something strong. Hallelujah. I want for you to turn your Bibles to Isaiah 40. Isaiah 40. Hallelujah. Somebody say hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless God. Isaiah 40. Jesus. I'm going to preach a very unusual message tonight. One that you might never hear before. Or you never hear it that way before. Hallelujah. But God told me to speak this word. I speak it the other day in Bronx. And God said, I want you to do it in Brooklyn again. Somebody say, Hallelujah. 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 Isaiah 40. And the 31st chapter. Hallelujah. Many of us can quote the scripture from the top of our head. It's a very familiar passage that a lot of us know about. And while I minister, please pray for me. Hallelujah. Isaiah 40, 31. Are you there? Yes. If you're there, say hallelujah. hallelujah. If you're not there, you say, hold on, preacher. Sorry, I'm not going hold. 